It's Horse Girl 1339 here, and today I'm going to be showing you a room tour. Some of, well, you guys on Instagram wanted to see my room, so I guess I will show you it. So this is my door. It just has one of those shoe hangers with my shoes on it and a little Lion King backpack that I used last year for school. A little, oops, like bead that thing that I made with my name and my dog's name on it. And a little bag that I got for Christmas. And over here is my viola case. I play the viola, so yeah. The left of my door, I'll show you over here. Please ignore my trash can. I still need to take it out, but haven't yet. And over here is my classic and stablemate shelf. I won't go in depth with these guys because I'll just make a I'll make a video later showing you all of it. Between there is just a little bag that has briars on it that I got for my birthday. And a little plug over there. And over here is my leopard geckos little cage. And she, you might see her head right there. And um, I still need to take down her Christmas decorations, but haven't yet. And over here is her food and her calcium and two little things that go to my photo printer that I got for Christmas and a little mealworm strainer that goes with her stuff. Over here is just my a letter that matches my name, I guess. And I was making clay Cruella de Vil for my mom because she really loves those things, but I haven't finished it yet. So she's just kind of dead over here. And in this barn shelf thing, I just have these little glass animals that my mom got for me when I was a baby. And some pins for a Lion King and a weird alien dude that my dad made with my clay. And a glass eagle. And just some more of those little animals. And over here is my messy earring hanger. I don't really wear earrings that much anymore, but... Yeah, and here I made a clay ring holder, but my cat broke it, so it's also dead. Shelf that is holding all that stuff. There's just some little, there's a painted ponies right there, a metal unicorn, and a like a tot totilius horse. I'm not sure how to pronounce his name, but I found that at a thrift store. And I just have him. He's one of those glass ones. Yeah. And over here is a bin of my craft stuff. And a little whistle thing. So, yeah. And over here is like two piggy banks. A little M that has glitter in it. A Akuna Matara thing. A picture of my dog and my um, siblings and my little cousin and a little I don't know what it's called but my dad got it when, it was, when he was in Colorado for me it like oil and water and stuff and down here is a bin of my animals that I don't play with anymore and down here is some of my favorite books and a fox and down here is a bin for my lep for my leopard gecko she just has a, a bunch of stuff in there and on this is my closet it has a little bag right there that says have a nice day that i got for my birthday and a little lion king wallet that i got for christmas 
And if you haven't noticed already, I like Lion King. So yeah. And inside my closet, I have my Schleich Barnes. And yeah. And then on this wall that's next to my closet, I have a little horse picture that I printed out because I had an empty picture frame and I just wanted to fill it. And then I made this, it's a quote. I really like it, it's pretty cute. And then over here is my dresser area. And right here, I just have little tacks that hold my necklaces. This necklace is my favorite. It's a glow in the dark one that I got from my aunt, which I really like. And this cool little viola little thing. And then a fossils poster that I got in fourth grade that I still have on my walls. And my TV and my Xbox and stuff. And right here are two pictures of horses that I got quite some time ago that I have not hung up yet. And behind my TV I have a broken necklace, a little beanie baby thing that was a chihuahua that looks like my dog. So I have it. Oof. One of my things just fell. And right here is a can of bookmarks. Back here is pictures of my dog because my dog passed away. So I just have a bunch of stuff for him. And a little cup that I found at the thrift store that has an M on it. So I got it and it holds feathers. This is not a real feather. It just, I found it in my room. So goes to my feather bucket. And over here is some movies that I like and yeah and above I have a little a mini little viola that I got for Christmas which is very cute because it ha comes this is a piece of clay and oops it comes with a little bow and if I can get it out a little a smaller version of this which is very cute. I really like it. And a little stand that came with it that holds them, but it doesn't really work. And a wooden M and behind it, I found it at a thrift store. I don't, I think it's like one of those um, things where you put to hold up your books or something, but yeah. And then next to that is a little Lion King picture that my mom got for me. And behind it is a little uh, canvas that I did a very long time ago when I, have hor when I had horrible artistic skills. And then this I painted this summer that I did at a class with my cousins, which was really fun. And it's very cute. And then down below is, I don't know if you want to see it because it's kind of gross, but it's some of my beta fish food. And I still need to get a better cage for her, but it's my tiger salamander, Glory, which her cage is very gross right now. I still need to fix that as well. So I just keep her in here. And then next to her is my crawfish which is named Mr. Krabs. You can kind of see his claws right there. But he was in one of these, but then me and my cousin fixed him up a new home. And then next to his cage is my beta fish cage. And he's right there. His name is Eclipse. Can't really see him. But, yeah, his filter isn't working out well. But... And in front are some Schleich horses that cannot, well, that do not fit on my shelf right now. So they're just down there. And next is a, a little music stand that I use when I play, practice my viola. And then right here is 
one of those neck coolers that I made in one of my classes at school. And then behind there is a big giant mess of pet stuff. And then right here is a very old art easel that I do not use anymore. That is a Wonder Woman pop head, a Simba pop head, a, bur a broken little headband that was Beauty and the Beast themed I did that I got at Disneyland, some little pet shops, and a little wolf that I got when I went onto the Park City Polar Express, um, two dragon fingerlings, one of those little egg things, but it's like animals, and it has a line on it. And then behind that is a little snowman that I got at church, and a cup that my friend made me for um, Christmas last year. And then in there, I got this at school, which is like a little flamingo pen, which I really like it. And then over there, is all my Schleich horses, which I'm not going in depth with those either because I'll just make a video about them. Camper and my bed. And then in my window, I have this little horse thing that I taped to it, which kind of shows through the light or something. So yeah, and then over here is a little thing that I made at church and behind it my friend made me it a long time ago which is very cute with a little horse on it and then here is a box that holds all my bracelets but I don't really want to open it right now and here I got a long time ago was a little lion cup it had grass that you could grow in it which my grass died, so I just kept the cup. And right here, I got with a Lion King movie, that, the Blu-ray version of it. And you might not be able to tell. It's like the Blu-ray, when you get the Blu-ray version of um, the Lion King, it comes with like this little video clip. It's very dark, and it's very dusty. So... It's when the monkey is lifting Simba into the sky, you know, that part, if you've watched Lion King. And over here is a little thing I found. Well, my mom found it, but it's just a lion thing. And then next to it is a mini Winnie snow globe that I, f that I made, which I just made... I just glued a mini mini onto a clay little like grass thing and made a fence behind it and put blue glitter in it because I didn't have any gl any other glitter. And then above that is one of those little Tsum Tsum um, chapsticks. It's a stitch one. And then right here is a book that I'm reading. Well, two books that I'm reading, which they're very good. And then right here is a little name that I got from my mom. That is mine. And then above my bed is a picture of another horse. By my bed is my nightstand, which has a photo printer, a charger to my laptop, and Alexa. And... <laughs> A little chart plug thing, which has my phone charger. Power plug, a male electrical connector with pins or blades which connect mechanically and electrically into holes or slots in a female electric... Yeah. It's a little horse thing. It's cute. I got it from my mom. And then next to my nightstand, down here, is a drawing book. It has all my, all my main drawings, some books down there, and books up there. And then next to there is my traditional shelf, which I will not go in depth with them either because I'll just make a video about them too. 
and this little boy, cutie pie, I got today from a trade that I did. And I'm so happy that I got him. Overview of my room. Thank you so much for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe. And comment down below what I what should I do for my next YouTube video.